Hello everybody, welcome to the wood shop tonight. Tonight we're going to talk about a subject of interest, a different kind of glue that most of you wood workers are not familiar with. But uh, uh, luthiers are very familiar with this glue. It's called hide glue. And it's a glue that used to be made from horses hoofs. Let me open the bottle here. One second, this cover's on kind of tight. There, the bottle open. And we look in at the glue. The glue's in this bottle. It's almost like coarse sand. Let me put the camera on macro. And we get right in and take a real close look at this glue. You see it's granular. Now, what these are, is these are glue pots. And they have a plug cord that plugs in. And they get hot in here. Now, here's a piece of glue that was in the pot still. See, it's went hard, crystalline. Now, that glue would come back again. If I put a little bit of water in there and heat that pot up, that glue will get soft again. And that's the thing about high glue. High glue, no matter how many years it goes, if you uh, put a little bit of hot steam on it, it'll, it'll ply separate. This is one of the things about musical instruments. Here's a mandolin I was building. <clears throat> and uh, it has high glue all down in the glue joints in here. And you see this is, is not finished. The back's not on it yet. Here's the other side of the mandolin. The face side. Turn it over again so you can see the high glue inside here. Down these joints. Now, doesn't matter how many years goes by, if you put hot steam on there, these joints will come apart. So you can repair a musical instrument that way with a high glue. So high glue is a very good hard glue. You can see how hard and durable this is. It's harder than the wood. That's a hard like a rock once it sets. Put a little bit of heat and steam to that and that will soften right up again. So this is why even though high glue is very traditional, it's still it's used in the making of musical instruments even today. Now here's a nice little teardrop mandolin. It's not completed but nice round back on it. Small, let me back up a little bit. Very small little mandolin. The maple. Uh, Parts maple and the, the face here. This is spruce. In the back, this back here is a very thin hard rock maple. And it's got spruce, spruce around here. Here's a mandolin that's almost completed. Of course, the strings aren't tightened up. Tighten the strings up to make more sound. <laughs> and it has uh, dry and heated my shop. It's developed a split on the back that I didn't notice. Anyway, I can repair that later. A split in the wood. But uh, this one. Uh, Little, this little mandolin. These are all this, these are all teardrop mandolins. Three of them. But they're put together with high glue. So high glue is a very interesting glue. It's a luthier's glue. And it's water soluble. And it has very practical purposes uh, so, and, and some other applications as well. It's getting hard to get this stuff. Uh, my supplier is Lee Valley. The bottle like this goes a long way. This is an old pasta sauce bottle. So there, that's about high glue and how it's used in the glue pots. Happy woodworking, folks.